Hey, what is going on guys? So you have a issue with your remote that goes to your Roku streaming stick and maybe it's one of the buttons not working, several buttons not working, or maybe it's ghosting, maybe it has a mind of its own and it's just pressing things. Anyways, I'm gonna show you guys how to get that up and running right now. So first thing I want you to do is grab the remote and I want you to pop the back off and go ahead and take out the batteries. All right, now once the battery is out, and this is gonna help like six, at least 60% of you guys, okay? There should be at least a 60% of thumbs up on this video. Anyways, the battery is out right now. Now what I want you to do is I want you to press each button for three seconds, okay? Every single button, hold it down for three seconds. One, two, three, 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 one, two, three. And even down here on the Amazon, Sling, and Netflix, and Google Play, hold down for three seconds, then let go. Then I want you to do this. I want you to press every single button in and out as fast as you can. Every single button, just keep on going. It's possible that you have like lotion or debris or like lint that's stuck in here. If one, if there's an issue with one button, it can cause a lot of funny things on the remote. Anyways, once you do that, now what I want you to do is Smack it on your hand like this on both sides. Go ahead and give it one more time. Go ahead and press every single button like that. Now go ahead and put the batteries back in. Put the batteries back in. And then don't put the lid on, okay? So leave the batteries back in. And then go ahead and turn your Roku on and play with it. See if you're still having issues, okay? If you're not, great. If you still are, do the same thing again. Go ahead and take out the batteries. And then I want you to press and hold each button for three seconds. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. And then after you hold all of them now for three seconds, and then I want you to press in and out on each button super quickly. Just go crazy, guys. I got tons of these remotes up and running simply by doing this, okay? And now give it a smack on both sides, on the bottom and the top. Put the batteries back in. See if it works. If it still doesn't work, give it a third try. Like I said, I should have at least 60% thumbs up on this video. If it worked for you, let me know, guys. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next one.